My name is Carmen Winant. I was born in San Francisco and grew up in Philadelphia and have most recently lived in Columbus where I moved in August to teach at the Columbus College of Art and Design. I consider uh, a lot of themes in my work. Uh, most of them come from a really pivotal experience that I had in my life as a competitive long distance runner. That was an experience, a really bodily experience actually, that I didn't think had anything to do with a creative life um, or an intellectual life. Um, and of, of course I was wrong. It was all of those, it was sort of the accumulation of, um, sort of all of those experiences of the body. The stakes of, sort of repetition and the stakes of failure and the stakes of exhaustion and stamina and performance anxiety um, really have made their way into my work, into my collage work, um, into my works on paper, uh, sort of thinking about how I can kind of enact those terms, in fact, in the studio and um, how sort of practice and performance can um, can have sort of variable meanings uh, sort of in different situations and circumstances um, and of course um, my work as I think of it is decidedly feminist um, and in conversation with feminist art history and sort of the radical feminism or the quasi radical feminism of my mother and of my mother's generation how can I think about failure as a feminist idea or, or performance as a feminist idea um, and so those are sort of um, I would say kind of twin currents that uh, that run through the work as I sort of became more interested in having a practice that mirrored the terms of my sort of athletic life and sort of thinking ab again about the way that my body breaks down and sort of uh, even like the chaos of my emotional life, um, I, I started to question uh, you know, the way that I was working in the studio and why I felt that everything had to be kind of contained in such sort of particular fashion. So uh, I, I really, uh, without much of a plan, started to just let myself kind of deliberately unravel and uh, realize that I didn't want tables, that I wanted to squat and that I wanted to spread things out and that I wanted to see everything all at once. Having everything on the floor um, where I can see it all at once eliminates anything close to an analytical sort of decision-making process and then it just sort of translates directly from there onto the wall. I think that the title of the show is a really interesting one. That line in particular for me has much more to do with the nature of being an artist um, and less sort of the particularities of my own work. Why sort of else would you become an artist if not uh, to, um, to create a channel to your own sentience?